Welcome. In this video, I'm going to be using iPerf3 to test the performance of this ingenious EWS357 AP access point. So I've done some other videos on this access point. I've done an unboxing and then a setup. I'll put a link in the description of my playlist and you can check out those other videos if you wish. Also, this access point was provided to me by Ingenious, but I've not been compensated for these videos and they are not reviewing these before I post them. So this is my own content. Also, if you find this video helpful and you want to buy one of these using Amazon, I'll put a link in the description to the product there. And it's my Amazon affiliate link and it helps me out a little bit and doesn't cost you anything extra. So I want to test the top speed of this. So I'm in the web interface for the Ingenious and I'll scroll down here. Uh, I'm clicked on uh, network wireless here and I've gone down here and I've enabled just the uh, five gigahertz wireless. I've just uh, disabled the 4.5 gigahertz. I'll hit edit here so you can see the other settings, what they look like. I haven't really changed much. I have a password on here and I'm logged into this network right now. So I'll go to my terminal and I'm going to type in iperf3-c space 192.168.7.175. And this is my laptop. So I have um, a laptop hooked up to my network using gigabit ethernet, and this is the IP address, and it's running iperf3 server. So I've done some videos on iperf3. I'll put a link in the description to my playlist on that. And um, I talk about setting that up on a Synology NAS, a Windows, Linux, Mac, different systems. So. And if you have any questions about that, definitely leave them below. So I'll run this test. So uh, the results is 183 megabits uh, send and 183 receive. So I should mention that I'm on a early 2015 MacBook Pro and the access point is in the basement about maybe 10 feet from my location. Now I'm going to switch over to my, um, it's a first gen iPad Pro, and I'll run the test on there also. Okay, so I'm on my iPad Pro here, and I've opened up this he.net network tools, and I'll tap on iperf on the left, and then I'll click at the top and I'll say iperf3, and I'll type in the IP address, which is 192.168.7.175, and then I'll click on bytes, and I'll type in 300m. And I'll click back on the IP address and I'll hit go, and this will run the test. Okay, so this doesn't really give us a summary, but you can see here we had start off at 157, and then it went to 170, and then you know 182, somebody's dropped down to 144. And I uh, ended up at 197, 196. So I'm not going to average all these together, but um, you can see it's similar performance to the laptop, but a little bit less. So this is just a basic iperf3 test I wanted to run. If you have any questions, please leave them in the comments. If you like this video, please click like. If you haven't subscribed to my channel, I'd appreciate it if you could do that. And thanks for watching. Until next time, goodbye.